Christians gathered early today at St. Mark's Cathedral in Luero for the consecration and installation of the fourth bishop of the Anglican Diocese of Luero. Following the start of the ceremonies, the Archbishop of the Church of Uganda, the Most Reverend Dr. Samuel Stephen Kazimba Mogalu, led the proceedings, including the consecration, before tasking the new bishop on his responsibilities. In turn, the new bishop accepted his responsibility of becoming shepherd of Luero. Many dignitaries, including ministers General Edward Katumba Wamala, who represented the president as chief guest, and Emos Lugorobi accompanied the new bishop from his holy diocese of Mokono. Also in attendance was the bishop of Kasanalwero Diocese, Right Reverend Lawrence Mokasa, while Meng was represented by the Speaker of Buganda Luchiko, Patrick Luagamogumbole, among other dignitaries. The clergy of Luero Diocese, represented by the lead archdeacons, then knelt before the new bishop to offer their loyalty to the new shepherd, vowing to obey him and preach the gospel. In his remarks, the new bishop called on the faithful of Luero to put the past troubles behind them. He instead tasked the clergy and faithful to focus more on furthering the gospel in the church and also propagating development. Mpititwa okusumba abantu bonna era nsubira okulabanga abantu benyigira mu buwereza mu buwereza katonda bwa mpitide. The Archbishop of the Church of Uganda addressed some of the complaints raised by the faithful following the annulment of Reverend Canon Godfrey Kasana Semakula who had been meant to be the bishop. He urged the locals to stay steadfast and work with their new bishop. Support and work with your new bishop in the transformation and reconciliation. Wax Minister General Edward Katumba Wamala apologized for the president's absence at the event, explaining that the invitation was at short notice. He pledged to offer the bishop a present of 50 million shillings and a vehicle to enable him to start his pastoral career. Moseven tasked religious leaders to partner with government in poverty alleviation programs that we continue in part partnering with the government in the wealth creation campaign to eliminate poverty amongst the believers. Habat Kamaga, NTV.